morning. It is 6.50 on May 3rd. And today I'm starting 75 hard. If you've been following me for a while, you know that last January through March 16th, I did 75 hard for the first time, completed it. And then again in the summertime, I got to day 68 of 75 hard and I failed because I didn't read one night and I went to sleep, woke up the next morning and realized it. For me, sometimes to have a big change in my mental and physical, I need the strictness. Sometimes to be able to see maximum results, mentally and physically, you need some sort of strictness. Um, and then after that, it becomes more of a balance. But I struggle with balance. I'm so, I don't know, like off. I, I don't do well with like a little bit of this here, a little bit of that there. Like I'm like all or nothing. And I, I'm trying to work on it, but I struggle with it. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't change a ton about my normal day-to-day -day life. Wow, this is a great angle. Um, doesn't change a lot about my normal day to day life anyway because I walk often, I work out like, you know, most days. Um, I drink water most of the time. I have been slacking my water lately. But the biggest thing is gonna be the reading and then just sticking to a plan when it comes to my diet and my nutrition. That's it. Um, all the kids are still sleeping. And I'm gonna make some coffee. I'm trying to debate if I wanna to fast today, if I want to start fasting again. I don't know. I like fasting a lot, but I really also enjoy my coffee in the morning. I've been using honey lately and it is so good. Um, for some reason, sugar-free sweeteners taste so disgusting to me now. Not the Starbucks one. If I go to Starbucks and get sugar-free vanilla, that doesn't taste bad to me. But the kind that I buy, uh, what do I get? The Tarani, or is that it? The ones that you can get at Walmart, um, they just taste bad. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling. Clearly I'm tired, I need to take my um, vitamins and medication and have some water and I'm gonna have some coffee and coffee, coffee, coffee. And then probably wake my kids up. I just realized that I told you it was May 3rd and it's actually May 4th. So may the 4th be with you. <laughs> I'm not even into Star Wars, so. But my husband is. And obviously my daughter, I guess. just pulled up at home so we did all of our morning stuff I haven't seen you guys in like a couple hours took Mara to school we went to, where did we go Jay Walmart home. yes we went to Walmart I grabbed oh my gosh I'll show you inside too but I grabbed a pair of these $12 jeans that everybody's been talking about on TikTok and I'm gonna make the shorts I'm gonna do that today because you know why not I've been wanting to for a long time I grabbed some CLA um, Let's see how that goes. I'm gonna start taking that every day. And then I got one more thing. What the heck? What's the last? Oh, I got floss picks to floss my teeth. Oh yeah. So we're gonna go inside. I'm gonna get the boys started on doing something. And um, I'm gonna start some laundry. Well, no, wait. I'm gonna switch the laundry. And then I'm gonna cut these jeans up. I might spray them with bleach too. But how long would I have to make them sit for if I sprayed them with bleach? Probably not long if I just want a little bit of discoloration. Either way, um, 
I'm really excited about these. And then it's starting to sprinkle. So we were going to go on a walk, but I think we're going to wait for the walk until I know that it's not going to rain on us. I wouldn't mind if it was just me, but I have the boys with me. So I have to think about them. If it does just keep raining, I'll just wait till later tonight when Russell can watch the boys and I'll walk then. Actually, Mara has dance class tonight. So I'll probably just walk during dance class because it makes sense. Mom. Yep. Hopefully it doesn't rain because I will have the boys with me. Okay, can you open it yourself? Yeah. Don't forget your drink and throw that, um, throw the trash in the trash, okay? All these trash. All right, so first I'll show you what I wore today. Just have on these leggings from Amazon. They're like a gym, gym shark dupe. They've got a little scrunch but they're like full length leggings and then I'm just wearing a tank top no bra and sweatshirt okay I'm gonna show you these jeans so these are the jeans they were like $12.97 $12.97 check them out um I got okay so I'm a little bigger right now meaning I don't really know what size I would wear uh I got a bigger size because um, if I want to, I can cut out a little bit in the back and like put a little dart in, um, if the waist doesn't fit me. Now I'll be really sad if the waist is too small because, um, I got 36 29s and that seems big, but if they're like men's jeans and they're like actual denim, I guess, right? Heavyweight denim. So there's like literally no stretch in them. So I'm gonna do some fun stuff with these. I'm actually gonna make a TikTok, so I won't show you the rest right now. I'll probably just include the TikTok on here, um, but I'll show you what they look like afterward. I'm just like really hoping that they fit because oh, holy crap, like this waist looks big enough for me, right? Ugh, now I think about it, it, it might not be. It almost goes halfway, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You guys, I decided I was gonna eat breakfast right now, but while my breakfast is in the air fryer, I just want to show you. I want to cry right now because I put these damn shorts or pants on. Just wait. This is not, it's not a good look for me. So the waist is fine. Act like, oh, it's so bad. Like I have all this room. I'm going to have to like take it in in some way. But so like, I can't really go up a size because the waist but you know these legs are not legs that are like a man's legs apparently. Um, so they're so tight, like they're good and loose up here, real loose up here, but like, look at my butt. It's like squishing my butt down, first off. It's so tight on my thighs, but what I'm hoping is, because they're denim, they should stretch as I wear them, but once I cut them into shorts, I might cut them into like pretty short shorts. Uh, It'll, I'll fray the bottom and it'll kind of loosen it up. I'm hoping. I'm like kind of devastated at the moment. I'm real sad because I thought I just wanted them to fit really well. But hopefully once I cut them, they'll be okay. But like the butt, I don't think, I don't think we can fix the butt. I can't get them to come up any higher. But I don't think we're fixing that. But maybe I'll do that, that thing where you put them on wet and then like, or no, put them on, get in the shower and then like move around in them until they dry and they'll fit better. But man, I feel like I failed. I'm still gonna do them though. All right, this is my breakfast. I've just got 100 grams of egg whites, um, two pieces of ham, and then I have a slice of like white American cheese and then I just threw some sugar-free ketchup on top. And then this is an ole wellness wrap and I just threw it in the air fryer for a little bit to get it a little bit crispy. Just getting ready to go pick up my niece. I got my roommate. If you don't have a roommate, what's wrong with you? I'll link them below there. The bomb. I'm having a white monster and uh, it's only 11, but no, it's 11.17. I decided not to do the jeans yet because I wanted to like be able to do it all like once we got back from picking up my knees. So I'm gonna have this so that when I get back, I'll be like, <sighs> hopefully, it's either I'll be <sighs> or I'll feel sick from too much caffeine. But you know what? 
I'm not gonna wait. I'm not gonna open it until we get in the car. No, we're gonna go. Um, bum, ba, dum. All right, in true just fashion, we are 30 minutes early. So I actually waited because I wanted to wait a little bit longer to crack open my monster. And that is just what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna crack it for you. Isn't that satisfying? So we're gonna sit here for a bit. Um, I thought I had something to edit, but I don't. So I have this partnership with, like, I guess I can't really say who, but anyway, it's a TikTok partnership and um, it's been so long and drawn out. They asked me like two months ago to do this partnership and I was like, yep, okay. And they, they even like, they offered more money because they're like, oh, can you sign this contract um, within two days? And here's the, whatever, the rush fee or whatever that they'll pay me for it being like so quick. So I was thinking, oh, this is gonna have to be a video I film really fast, like get it back to them. And still the video got um, reviewed and there was one edit they wanted me to make. And that was just like two days ago. And then I sent it back and no, I'm still waiting for the final, um, whatever, review to be okay to post it. And I'm like, dude, I filmed this video like a month ago. We talked about this like two months ago. So weird. Content creation is just the weirdest thing. Anyway, I'm picking up my niece. Then we're going to go to Hobby Lobby. I probably won't. I'm not, not probably. I won't vlog while I have her just because I'm not going to put her on here. She's not my kid. Um, but... We'll check back in with you later, or maybe I'll show you. We're gonna go to the fabric store. I want to try to find some fabric for my softball girls. I wanna find something that has like bees or wasps or something. Our team name is the Stingers, so I want like a hornet or a wasp or a bee of some sort. Um, like on it, scrunchy or some kind of fabric. I'm sure I'm gonna find something, but hopefully I'll find something. But I thought that'd be a fun little gift for them. Um, I gotta pick up Mara from school. We're going to the gym and then Mara has dance class. So a lot of stuff, not a lot of stuff. It's just like boom, 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 boom. I just missed my mouth. Did you see that? Did you see that? We're back home now. I look like trash because it's raining, but I'm having my lunch. So Olay wellness wrap. I've got two pieces of ham, honey mustard. I think it's fat free honey mustard and then a slice of cheese and lettuce. I'm gonna eat this and then I think I'm finally gonna do the jeans thing. Snack time and to update you, those pants are still sitting over there. I don't think I'm getting chewing until later, maybe tomorrow. Still chewing my snack, but I got a doorbell ring. Ooh, from Amazon. It came from UPS though. Does UPS deliver Amazon packages? Okay, hold on. I'm gonna set you up here. Turn this lights off so it doesn't look so shitty. I think I know what this is. Let's see. It show is. Look at this. CBJ is my coaching online coaching business. Coached by Jess CBJ. That's what that is. So I just have this T-shirt. So I have a, this is, you might be wondering why that came from Amazon. I, <laughs> that was disgusting. Um, I have a merch by Amazon account, so I can literally, if as long as it's me designing it and it's not a copy written like design, like I, if I tried to like print a, I don't know, like a chief's symbol, they wouldn't let me do that. But as long as I, I can design anything I want and I can just get it printed, it's print on demand. So instead of like going to a company and being like, hey, buy, make this shirt for me, I can just make it myself. I mean, I can just, I, obviously I made my logo, but um, I can just have it made and it'll be here in three days. So look at that, so cute. So I actually have other merch on Amazon. Um, if you've watched and seen like the smiley tee, and then my, like, I love you, make a different shirt. I don't have a bra on, <laughs> obviously you can tell. Uh, like this is just a tank top. But this is a different shirt. So those are the regular tees. 
This is the premium tee. And I can already tell the difference in the fabric. It's like just a little bit more um, flowy, not flowy, drapey, if that makes sense. Like it's a little softer, a little more drapey. The arms are a little bit longer, kind of like that. So anyway, I'm excited about that. I'm gonna wear this to the gym today, I think. Yeah, anyway, um, I'm gonna change. I wanna wear some shorts to the gym. I haven't looked up the workout yet, but I do wanna wear shorts. So I'm gonna go find a pair of shorts um, in a bra and thank you Ziggy for telling me my package got delivered. I already have it. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get dressed. We're going to pick up Mara and then go to the gym. So I think I really want to eat. No, I really want to drink something before I go. I might make another coffee without any honey, just like coffee with creamer. Um, because I just really want something to drink that's not water. I do need to drink some water though. Whoa. Totally forgot to show you anything at the gym, but nothing fun anyway, because the workout fucking sucked so bad. It was 25 minutes, six dumbbell thrusters, 40 pound dumbbells, uh, six toes to bar, and then 36 fucking, fucking double unders. And if you don't know, when I do double unders, I pee my pants. So that was fun. Woo. Okay, pro tip on broccoli. Um, I just buy the broccoli florets, not the cuts. And I steam them for like four to five minutes. And then, instead of eating them, I put them, I spray olive oil, put them on the tray, and then salt and pepper. So I'm gonna pepper and salt. Look, I'm gonna try to do this with one hand. Oh, look at that. Okay, hold on. All right, so salt and pepper on here. And then instead of baking, I just broil on high and then I put them in here. This just gets them, if you like burnt broccoli, gets them nice and burnt and they're way really better. day one of 75 hard and of course it's raining I think I went like 40 something days the first time through without it raining I mean there was a lot of snow but I think I'd take the snow over the rain just because I don't know you can like layer up and be fine with the rain it's like even with the umbrella you're still getting wet but we're doing it this umbrella is so cute it's Mara's she got it for her birthday from Russell's mom. And it's like, you know, the little see-through. I'm gonna get a big one of these, but clear instead of pink. Anyway, I'm gonna keep going. My phone's gonna get wet if I keep having it out. So, here we are doing the things. I still need to take my progress picture and read, but um, I'll do that when I get home. I think my glasses just fogged up. Oh my goodness, it is the next day. I forgot to close out the video last night. So after dinner, um, I had oatmeal with protein, dark chocolate, and peanut butter, and that was pretty much it. But I'm out of breath. We just got done walking, um, so I just did my 45-minute cardio this morning with the boys. It is cold, kind of, and wet, but, like, I'm sweating so bad because I wore a sweatshirt and sweatpants. It's, like, cold but humid. I don't know if that even makes sense. Um, so we're headed home, but I wanted to come on here and close out this video and just say thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe if you're not subscribed. It really helps out my channel. Give me a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next one.